Hello everyone, Gadget Girl Kylie here. Welcome back to my Let's Play walkthrough of Tales of Zestiria. Continuing from where we left off, we need to go ahead and meet with the girl. Grandpa wants her out. Silly Grandpa, can't you see that Sori's got a soft spot for her? Haha. -ha. Anyway, let's go in our house. Hey. Oh yeah, I remember. Hey, wow! Is this crest what I think it is? Yep. This is the mark of the shepherd. I knew it! The chosen one who communicates with the seraphim, controlling their incredible powers as if they were his own. The shepherd! <laughs> Sound like your kind of thing? Maybe. I always thought that Mankind's Savior would actually look a bit more imposing. <laughs> Be silent, Seraph Beast! I shall not. <laughs> <laughs> Excavated relics aren't play toys. True. She certainly is taking her time. I'll see what's up. Suspicious. Yeah, just a little bit. Okay, so where is she? Oh, there she is. Hmm. Enjoy yourself? I sure did. But it's weird. I felt like I was being watched the whole time. <laughs> Fungus. I'm sorry. I feel like I'm going to faint. Let's head to my place. Let's Gosh, have some alone I hope we didn't time. worry him. Hmm? Oh, uh, nothing. Welcome in. What's your hometown like? Well, I'm from the capital, Lady Lake, in the Kingdom of Highland. That sounds Lady nice. Lady Lake? Like in the Legend of the Sacred Blade? You've heard of it? It was in the Celestial Record! The legend says the Lady of the Lake guards the Sacred Blade, and the one who draws it becomes the Shepherd, right? Yes. It was a lively and bustling town, blessed with bountiful water. Rich in festivals and fine drink. Wait, was? Well, it used to be. Things must be hard for folks in the world below. Below? The land that lies beneath the mountaintops. I've never left home before. You've what? always lived here by yourself? Sounds to me like you're the one who's had it rough. <laughs> if only you knew, girl. Oh, I'm let not me help alone. You get ready for your return trip tomorrow. You need anything? Bread, rations, stuff like that? That'd be great. If you have any tools or a sleeping bag, it'd be great too. Gotcha. Well then, first we'll need to do some hunting. I'll be your guide tomorrow. Thank you so much for everything. Yeah, you're not getting it for free. You've got to work for that meat, girl. <laughs> Go out hunting together. That's Good how morning. it works. Good morning. Come on! Hurry it up, Mikleo. We ain't got time to mess around. Yeah, I'll leave in a moment. <sighs> Gramps gave me all kinds of things to take care of. I'm gonna be pretty swamped for a while. Bummer. Well, don't you worry about me, at least. So, Ray, Gramps only wants... Yeah, I know. Mikleo! Haha, <laughs> just looks like Maybe he's crazy later. to her. Sure. 
He's talking to himself. Do I really want to go out with this guy alone hunting in the wilderness? You sleep okay? Hmm. <laughs> yeah, like a log. Been ages since I've done that. All right then, shall we? The prickle boars lurk to the left of the entry gate. It's an ideal hunting place. Got it. Let's go get us some boar meat, guys. Wonder if she'll be joining us in combat. Let's have a look. Oh, she does. Interesting. We still don't know her name, though. Oh, didn't mean to do that. Equipment. Don't think I have. Titles. You can think of titles as unique equipable items that enhance character stats when wearing them. By completing events and leveling up with a particular title equipped, its proficiency will go up allowing you to learn new skills. I'll leave that one equipped for now. What's Sore got equipped? I'm going to equip that for now. Right, let's go. Get some meat. Fresh. Still wriggling. Tried to do Gollum then, but totally didn't do Gollum's voice. I kind of boar. don't want to kill it. <laughs> so that's one, huh? Their meat is easy to preserve when smoked and super tasty. And the skin has all kinds of uses too. I almost feel sorry for it. Want to leave? No, my spirit is prepared. <laughs> Besides, my body I can't get is this ready. Sort of experience back home. Okay. Here we go! Well, at least it's had a nice life out in the wild. But it's time to die, Bo! Yeah! Be gone! Let's get him! It's over! Hey, pretty smooth move! Thank you. You're rather capable yourself. Be gone! Have I truly Sweet. been of use? Okay! Guess we need a few more. I don't see any around. You'll find him if you look. So, probably down here somewhere. Is that a monolith? Monolith. Quick step. You square plus the left stick to quick step to the side. That allows you to evade top down and stabbing attacks while still recovering SC. This is called a quick evade and it both lowers that enemy's attack frequency and gives you a chance to counter attack. Invaluable against enemies who only use top down attacks. If you aim to recover SC with quick steps, be sure to dodge at the very last second. Any earlier and it will merely count as a regular physical dodge, not a quick evade. Interesting. There is a treasure chest over here. Yeah. 
See if there's any treasure. Or conversation opportunities as well. Focus oh, it ran into me then. down here now. I finished preparing the gel. Nice. Hunted enough. So now what shall we do? Let's head home for the day. Okay, cool. That was easy enough. Looking forward to getting some flashy moves in this game. Is it to Lady Lake? Let's see. I expect about two or three days. Really? I had no idea it was so close. But the forest at the base of the mountain is surprisingly easy to get lost in. Must be the power of Gramps' domain. I bet yeah, he'll want to go, won't he? Because he's never explored outside before. He's going to be really curious. Ray? Oh, did I wake you? Sorry about that. You're sure into that book, aren't you? I've read it countless times since my childhood. One day, I want to explore ruins all over the world. Everyone who's read the Celestial Records says that, and I'm no exception. But sadly, now is not the time for some jaunt around the world. For several years now, the world has been plunged into a nigh-incomprehensible state of chaos. Chaos? Mysterious illnesses, incessant storms, people bursting into flames. Whoa. There are those that say, even the dead have begun to walk the earth again. Whoa, hang on. What are you talking about? You don't believe me? Or you think this is a joke? No, I... The situation is beyond grave. Huh? The chaos has caused abnormal climate changes all over the world. As a result, 
we are on the verge of enduring widespread crop death, famine, and starvation. And worst of all, are the rumors of governments planning to replenish their dwindling resources through war. It mustn't come to that. Can nothing be done? Who knows? There's nothing to hang on to but legends. Which is why you... No, never mind. I won't ask. I think I'm gonna just hit the hay here myself. Sleep well. Well, at least he's a gentleman, giving her the bed. He gets the hard floor. Hard, cold, stone floor. Good morning. Good morning. You ready to get to work? We gotta make those rations and bags from the prickle boars we hunted yesterday. You got it. <laughs> Afraid it isn't exactly super fun, though. Well, let me know when you're ready to start. Ready? So, what do you need me to do? Sorry for putting you to work like this. Oh, I'm pretty used to it. With your help, I'll be able to leave tomorrow. Thanks so much. Yeah? Great. Well, better rest up for tomorrow. I ought to let Gramps know. Wish I'd asked her more about the world below. I wonder if she honestly just thinks we're nuts. <laughs> or if she does think we are talking to people. She just can't see them. Hey, Gramps. She says she's leaving tomorrow. I see. We'll all be sure to see her off. After all, one must always be hospitable to one's guests. Even though she can't see you. Thanks! <laughs> oh, that was a creepy smile! <laughs> I really owe you. Thank you so much. You gonna be okay by yourself? I cannot cause more trouble for you than I already have. I see. <sighs> you'll be fine. Just follow that map and you'll get through the forest with no problems. Oh, it's not that. I believe you. Alicia. Huh? That's Finally. my name. Alicia Difta. Alicia? You didn't even know who I was, and you helped me without asking anything in return. Whereas I thought only of myself, leaving you without even a name by which to call me. As a knight, I am ashamed. Please find it in your heart to forgive me. It's okay. I must confess something to you. Hmm? I know this sounds strange, but I believe that the Seraphim really do exist. The myths and legends that are preserved in the Celestial Record must be more than mere fairy tales. Yeah. This crisis that has befallen our world, I believe only the one spoken of in the ancient legends can truly restore order. The Shepherd, you mean? You're not going to ridicule me? Everyone back in town does. Of course not. You're a real saint, you know that? The Sacred Blade Festival is soon to commence in Lady Lake. A trial will be held based on the legend of the Shepherd's Sword. A trial I think you might be interested in. Me? Time to go. But please, give it some serious thought when you have the time. How come? The shepherd I see in my mind when I read the legends. I have to say, he reminds me a lot of you. <laughs> no pressure. What's this? 
Gramps asked me to go out and search the ruins and find some clues about that girl. I've been down there looking. So wait, this is Alicia's? This is the crest of Highland. I don't think this Alicia is any ordinary knight. I know this is difficult for you, but it really is for the best. Gramps? Hmm. Someone has infiltrated my domain. Oh. Blast and damnation! Hiding your presence, are you, crafty bugger? Everyone, be warned! There is an intruder in our realm! Find them! They've concealed their presence, so chances are good it's a Hellion! Search with extreme caution! We'll go too. Very well. If it is a Hellion, quick measures must be taken. I'm counting on you. I have a hunch we'll find it around the forest. Good idea. So is this going to be kind of like a boss fight? Got royal knife. Can we actually equip that or...? No. Okay, cool. Alright guys, cliffhanger time! I am going to go ahead and stop this episode here, so don't forget to like, comment, favourite, share, and of course subscribe if you hadn't done so already. And as always guys, thank you for watching.